Hello everybody, third time's the flipping charm. Welcome back to more Mega Modded. I have tried recording this run uh, three separate times now, and it just, like, my game just keeps crashing a lot. Anyways, we're gonna try it again. I got the lost. We're gonna hope, I, I've... I've verified my game files, I've changed a bunch of things, I've uninstalled a few mods to see if it helps, and we're gonna hope for the best, but yeah, game just seems to be crashing a lot today, and I don't know about you guys, but game crashing on its own is pretty annoying. Game crashing when you're trying to record a video is infuriating. I don't care if it happens once, but when it crashes and I have to replay the entire floor because it crashed at the very end, and I have to do it, multiple times it's incredibly frustrating and it makes recording a video take three times longer than it should and i have very limited time to record videos because i'm on my lunch break so yeah this is annoying anyways 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 let's continue on hope for the best pretend everything's good pretend everything's well pretend i'm not sad anyways as for the question of the day today what is your favourite flavour. What is your favourite flavour of anything? Ooh, red stew. Um, yes please, I will take red stew. I know that I could maybe re-roll that into a good character room item, but just being able to blast through these first few floors speaks to me on a level that I, yeah, I'm just, I'm in love with that. I mean, obviously it's not going to last us that long, um, but we will try our best and see what we get here. Is this, oh, this isn't even a combat room, that's kind of perfect. I was expecting that to be a really annoying combat room. But yeah, being able to blast through enemies like that, and obviously we get the red stew bonus back a little bit each time we do that. Freezer baby is a great grab here. I know that I shouldn't do extra rooms really, but I was just about to say we could get a mini boss. There you go. A burn heart for our troubles. Right, one second. Let's keep going. One, I just need to pause one sec. Let's keep it going. I'm going to have to start, like, pause intermittently here just because I'm discussing my crashes with some of the modders to see if I can find out what the hell's going on because I really want it to stop because yeah as I said um it's really hard to record videos when you're doing this but anyways back to the discussion that this discussion is one that I've spoken about th three times now this will be the third time um so it's, a, it's it's been a little bit frustrating but my favorite flavor um for me it kind of oh oh baby oh la, 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 la. um I don't know why that's there. I realize that I'm going to be wasting my red stew, but I feel like I, ha I owe it to myself to try and get that. And I think there was a nickel-eyed keeper in the shop, if I remember correctly. There's also a few poops about. There's also that. That's one thing. Okay, we didn't actually go into the shop. Um, okay, so I think we bomb this. See how much we get. You little cheapskate. Two coins. Two. That is terrible. Right. Okay. Hope for the best here. That's a heart. God damn it. Damn it. And come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes, baby. Okay, there you go. That that is gonna help. That is gonna help a lot. I'm very excited. And please no crash. There you go. That's one floor down. One second. Okay, we are back once more. Let's go in here. We've still got a little bit of red stew bonus to go. Do you know what? I might as well go for this. Nah, nothing amazing. But yeah, we still got a little bit of red stew bonus in us. We'll see if we can make use of it. Having flight on this floor is so nice. But yeah, I'm actually kind of excited for today as well, um, just because, for one, I got up and I had my, I've been having protein shakes a little more, and this kind of leads into the, uh, the what's your favourite flavour uh, question, because I've been having strawberry milkshakes a lot, and pro stra strawberry pro protein shakes, and it just made me think of it, that is annoying, it just made me think of like, what's my favourite flavour, because I've just been loving protein shakes right now. Um, and like I said, the strawberry ones especially. But yeah, I'm kind of excited for today just because it's a really, really nice day. Um, almost lost our red stew bonus at this point. I'm kind of hoping that Freezer Baby does some magic here. What on earth just happened there? That guy almost telefragged me like crazy. It'd be funny if using, uh, using this 
give him a holy mantle back, but I don't think that's quite going to be the case. Is it just you guys left? No, it's not. God damn it. How are you still around? Good. Slightly annoying, but we got it. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Yep, I, I actually am very surprised I didn't get hit there. Very. So, unfortunately here, we're, we're, our red stew bonus is almost over, and I almost died straight away. Wow. Damn, that was a quick kill. Okay, we'll leave that there for now. I think nine lives is a must grab. Rotten Apple doesn't actually do anything for us. Yeah, I was going to say, I tried to re-roll it, because this is at least worth something, whereas that's worth nothing. Um, and we're just, this is where my game always crashes. So, I'm going to quickly do this, just to make sure I don't have to replay the whole floor over again. Because this is where it kept crashing. <laughs> Let's see. Please don't crash. Oh my lord, it's happened. We're on for a good one. But yeah, it's a very nice day out today. Um, and I'm kind of excited to just head out and play some more Pokemon Go. I've been playing it a lot recently, as I said. I've been really loving it, to be honest. I played it a lot in 2016. It's kind of one of those games that, like, I didn't expect it to be as good as it is. And there's definitely some issues I have with it and some things that still aren't perfect. But it's it's pretty good. I don't know how many people actually care about it, but I, I quite like it, right? What, what we got here? We got... 45% chance to double the effect of eating pills. Um, or offers random discounts on all shop items. I like that better, to be honest. And do you know what? Saves us a key. Let's do this. And tech point five. Yes, please. Yes, please. Better than glitter bombs. I actually love tech point five. It's so good. But yeah, I've, I've got a new, uh, a new contract on my phone now. So I have much better 4G. Because I was on the 3 network. Honestly, if anyone's on the 3 network or has been in the, in the past, it's really awful, isn't it? <clears throat> it's really awful. Ooh, okay, so 12, I think 12 cent for the blue map is certainly the avenue that I wish to take here. Certainly the avenue I wish to take. Oh, this, this tech point five has upped my damage by a lot. It's so very good. We'll see if we get enough money to actually utilize the shop here, but I don't know. What's that? Chests have a high chance to be angel chests. Now, if we had more keys, actually, we do have a good amount of keys, but I'd, I'd take that if we had <coughs> a better supply. Sorry, I am still a bit ill here, so I'm going to have to pause now and again to cough as I just did. I apologize. Okay, with the fast flies, this room is a little scary. But I think the piercing makes it a little more plausible. Get a Wheel of Fortune. I'm going to pop that. In fact, pop and bomb it. Hey, one bomb for two bombs. What a trade. What a trade, baby. But yeah, had some really interesting runs in the in the past ones that were, that, that, where the recording died. I had one where I started with Cursed Eye and another one where I got Flip. And it's like... Really cool runs. Would have been would have been fun. I mean, this one's definitely interesting. We've got like Pyro and stuff. It's not not quite all the same. Ooh, that is nice to get Binky there. We didn't get enough money. I'm just gonna head on down. Let's keep it going. Apparently my game is haunted. One second, I need to pause. Okay, apparently I'm getting like redonkulous amounts of errors. So I sent a few modders my uh, my past crashes logs and they just sent me a thing back where there's like multiple mods spamming the same error about UI card fonts not being accessible and they can't figure out why. <laughs> and it's happening with multiple mods as well. So yeah, uh, don't really know what's going on. Um, seems to be that something is cursed. Seems to be that I broke something somehow, somewhere, and I don't, I don't know how or why or what I did, but there it is. But speaking of this run, though, speaking of actually this run, we have nine lives, so we are in a very good position to get a win here. Um, I think the lost in itself is pretty good for getting wins. Oh my lord! Don't give me an item where I have to take damage, please. That's kind of rude. I always forget that Binky makes you smaller. I was like, why am I so teeny tiny? Why am I such a baby? Oh, that is beautiful. Be ready for this fella. There you go. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. 
Oh, and I had nine volt in another run, so I had a one room charge on my active, which was awesome. It's a bit sad, and, I, and now I'm getting the runs kind of confused between each other, and I'm like, which, which run am I on now? Which items do I have? Right. Let's go back through here. Try again. PhD. That's more like it. That's more like it. Feels like I'm walking on sunshine. Um, one second. Okay, that, that sort apparently they've also found some of the errors that are maybe causing the crashes I get with the tainted treasure rooms. I'm just having a full diagnostic done. This is like kind of going to your GP and being like, what the hell's wrong with me? I'm getting like a, I'm getting like a, a an annual checkup and my game needs it. It is dying. Got ourselves a tinted, not tinted card, but kind of tinted card. Homing for the room spawns friendly psychic moors. I'll take that. I don't really need to feel like I'm walking on sunshine, to be honest. It's invincibility, but you can't shoot. Um, we do have enough for shop, so we'll go back to shop. Let's take a look. See, the FPS does seem to be a bit more stable since I verified my Steam files, so... That's hopefully a good sign for later. I don't know. We'll see. Grab, grab. It's always annoying. Like, sometimes the shop is right next to the boss room. Other times it's like, nah, I'm going to be miles away. I'm going to be ages away for you. Got him. Grab all of that. Ooh, do you know what? That's actually... Okay, we'll, we'll check our shop first, but that's actually really good because we can get in those for free. So getting an extra cash room per floor could give us some really good items. Let's check this first. Okay, this is actually better because we might get Steam Sale or we might just get a lot of money. I kind of prefer a lot of money, to be honest. There you go. This is good stuff. We should be able to get that now. Some spiders. No, thank you. We should be able to get Voodoo Pin now. I'd hope. With this, with this amount of money, we should. Okay, there we go. Good, good, good. Did take a little more than it should have done, I'll admit. But it's put us in a good place. Means that next few floors, we get extra cash rooms. That's good with me. We'll go do our boss. We'll use our fo uh, my foiled magician card as well. It spawns the psychic moss right on top of him, which is not ideal, but do you know what? It works. Um, what have we got here? The Veil of Darkness grants Curse of Blight, plus three black hearts, and grants one of the following items. Um, I guess. Hey, there you go. That's pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. I'm pretty happy with that. Okay, let's keep it going. Apparently, tainted treasure rooms is one of the things causing the crashes when I enter new floors as well. So we're learning all sorts of stuff here. Mod Diagnostics, The Wonders of Science. Thank you for checking up on me, people. Seeing what's wrong with my game. Is that PJs? I don't know why I took it, because I kind of knew it was PJs, but it was kind of like an instinctual thing. I'm like, ooh, an item that is good, but it's not actually good for us. It is an item that's good, that's still the case. Didn't quite work out, though. Okay, apparently freezing these guys doesn't actually work. <laughs> It, com it just confuses the game. I don't know what this guy's going to do, so I'm a bit scared. Okay. Yeah, I definitely should have re-rolled it. But oh well. Oh, uh, to the well. But yeah, I wonder if um, any of you guys are playing Pokemon Go. I've been just adding loads of random people, so... <laughs> I'm like, send me gifts. Did anyone play it, like, back in its heyday? Back in its peak? I, rem I even I remember when it, when it first came out, because I've always been big into Pokemon, so I, w I was really excited when it came out. It was, like, 2016 when it came out, right? Something around that. Um, but, yeah, I even remember uh, 
I got myself like a, a bicycle mount for my fern so I could like bike around and catch eggs and <laughs> go catching things. It was a lot of fun actually. I really enjoyed it. Uh, that's Krampus's head. Ah, oh, dude, it's a 30% chance to delete items and it feels like it's happening every time right now. We've got whatever this is. Mr. Dolly. Does Mr. Dolly normally appear and things like that? But a fire right up is certainly not bad. <coughs> I'm certainly pr pretty happy with it. And I like the fear shot too. The fear shot's helping out. Good, good. Charged key. We got our shop and our item room right off the bat here as well. This is pop. This is another item I had on one of my old runs. I'm glad to have it back. Also works nice with um, Tech Point 5 too. That's Piggy Bank. I'll take the card. We got Judgment. I can never really remember what the Judgment card does, to be honest. Um, spot. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. Very happy with that. Very happy with that. Spawn ourselves a reroll machine. But yeah, pop should pop should be pretty good here, especially with Tech Point 5. We got a lot of eyeballs in the air. Eyeballs in the air. But yeah, like I started like a new account on it and everything because I like I said I'm in like a new city now and it's just kind of like I don't know I I, I felt like it was a lot better to just start afresh. But yeah, like, like me and my mates used to go out and play it all the time. I, like I didn't actually realize as well because I only started playing it because I saw like a post on Reddit about it. it. Was like oh yeah, I used to play that game a lot and I'm trying to get out and be more healthy. So this this could be a good avenue to do that. And um, that's Midas Touch. I don't know why I picked it up yet again. Um. I kind of didn't mean to this time, to be honest. It just happened. It is what it is. Uh, let's go and get out of the curse room, because we do have another one somewhere. I just keep picking up items that I don't actually intend to pick up, and uh, unfortunately, taking items that are almost virtually useless to us. PJs and Midas Touch are both pretty useless. Actually, saying that... Yeah, Midas Touch isn't all useless. As long as I'm careful, Midas Touch with Holy Mantle is actually pretty decent. You do have to be confident you won't get hit after the fact, though, which is not easy. Hey, look at that. Pretty good. We might be able to use this a little more than I initially thought. Yeah, this is this is better than I thought it would be. And we've got nine lives as well, so we don't even have to worry that much about if we do get hit. I like this. It's a good setup. Go, my pretties. My eyeballs of fury. There it is. There's our second curse room. Hopefully we get some items here that we can use the restock machine on. We did get some pills though. Pills are good. Two I found pills. Teratogenesis. Friends till the end. A health up. Speed up's definitely the best one here. Right. And back we go. Back we go. Ooh, giant poop room. Interesting. Use the bombs there. The bombs will help. The center. Yes, much better reroll there. Much better reroll. Destroy the giant poops for minimal payouts, but it's still nice to have them. They're good to have about. And then hopefully next time we get like a devil deal that we can use our reroll on. Getting a lot of triple chest rooms here as well. Or quadruple chest rooms based on the last one. Okay, so here's our devil deal. We've got Ouija board and Torn. Both of these are not good for me. Um, I think that's Void Bombs and I, I really don't recognize that one. Twisted Pear? We'll definitely take Twisted Pear. 
And then we got Guppy's Paw. We'll pick it up. We'll come back and try and reroll it though. But yeah, Twisted Pair is a great one for us, especially with Paw. What is going on with that fella? He is not having a good time. The fear is setting in for him. We got ourselves bomb bag from that for some reason. I don't know why bomb bag's in that pool. It shouldn't be. That pool kind of messes up sometimes, though. Some runs it's fine, and other runs it's like. lol no. Okay. <laughs> <coughs> A golden penny here as well. Let's see how much we can get from it. Oh. I just love this arcade room music. And there's Guppy's collar. Okay, so we got two Guppy items. Okay, wait. What, what are the Guppy Oh, we have nine lives, of course. Okay. We just got Guppy. I was not expecting that. I was most certainly not expecting that. So I'm very happy. Wasn't planning on a guppy run. But this is an interesting one, too. The straw. Daddy long legs. Most definitely daddy long legs, thank you. More red chests. We're getting a lot of those recently. Experiment. Oh, so many I found pills. HP up again. You've got to be kidding me. So many. Got damn HP ups and another golden penny. Wow. I mean, I realise that this is our last floor where we can actually use the golden pennies, really. But it's still worth doing the extra task of picking them up. I, by the way, I do realise, by the way, by the way, by the way, I'm going to say by the way a few times now for some reason. Um, But I do realise that there's quite a few mods out there that are like time saving mods. There's like Good Trip, which I've been asked to use a few times. Uh, I think BD1P uses it and a few other people do, which essentially just lets you teleport around. But. It doesn't account for the time it should have taken to walk between those rooms, which essentially means that you can cheat objectives like boss rush and stuff. So I've just always kind of been against the idea of that. And then there's also the one <coughs> that makes it so that you, um, makes it so that you pick up golden pennies like all at once. And those ones I've kind of thought of as well, but it's also, I kind of like the chase. <laughs> I kind of like going around and getting everything I can from these. Wait, there's so many haunted chests here, what the hell? Um, that's the menorah. That's unfortunately not very good for us. Really, it re-rolled into breakfast? What? The menorah is like an on-hit effect, which doesn't work for us, so. Oh shit, there's another hand. What's with all the haunted chests, game? What's going on? What's this as well? Habit. Unfortunately useless. And... School bag. And... The battery. And... Car battery. Yeah, we get like so many haunted chests right now. I get I guess that I've got a lot of luck upgrades, but shouldn't they just be regular chests? Why are we getting just haunted chests? It's kinda nutty. Because there's all the spookers about. All these ghosty fellas. <laughs> Will that bomb get you? I don't know if that did, to be honest. It's okay though, we're gonna drop just an absolute ton of tears on you. We are making boss rush here as well, and I don't think we've done boss rush, so good to grab it. Good, good. We we need to be taking dark path here. We've already seen the devil deal, right? Yes, we have. Okay, we've got blister shot, I think that is. I don't know what that is. I don't know what that is. And that's lemon mishap. Let's take this. Lil Dumpy! Yes! Lil Dumpy's incredible! Just remember to pick him up. 
Okay, I died straight away. I mean, we could try it again, I guess. Oh, no, we can't. <laughs> I kind of forgot that that's how that would work. I also lost my plus 10 luck. Damn. No worries, though. No worries. We didn't get Bosch Rush. It's not a big deal. We'll take the Dark Path on and see how we do. As I said, this is why we have nine lives. <coughs> really apologize about the coughing. <clears throat> I'm trying to stop it whenever I can. Golden Troll Bomb. Lovely. I'm really happy to have a little Dumpy, because he's essentially like an extra Holy Mantle. He's very beautiful. He got a pretty insane buff. Turned him from pretty garbage to actually detrimental into basically as good as Holy Mantle. But kind of better because you can use it multiple times a room. <coughs> it's kind of insane how good it is. Oh god, they're sucking in all my shots. I love the way that because of the... Uh, Twisted Pair and the Tech Point 5 were shooting out like various sizes of pop shots and like slightly different colours and stuff as well. It's pretty. It's very pretty, but yeah, I can actually feel just how warm it is right now. It is incredibly warm, so it's like I've got a uh, I've got some work stuff to do after this, but after that I am heading straight out. Out into the open world to see what's what. Hopefully my uh, my new contract switches over soon. It's supposed to do it for anywhere from 11 to 5 today. And it is currently <coughs> half 11. So any time now, really. I'm really hoping it's sooner rather than later. Okay, good. Okay, so Guppy's going to help us out here. I'll get some bombs on you as well. Did that miss? It did. There you go. This guy has a bit of boss armor too, but he can be dealt with. Curse the reverse and some of those rocks there. And we got a circle. Magic 8-ball. Damn. It, the Curse of Light is tricky. This, I, I, you don't realize how many items are just like a shape. Like, the, I don't know what syringe that is, so let's re-roll it and get the pentagram. Because that's a shape that I recognize. Honestly, the amount of, like, wallage we can set up here. Oh, you car spawn on the other side, didn't you, you big bitch? My dumpy guy's back again. Just gotta remember to collect him. Once you've collected him, he's good to go. Oh my god. The charging fury of Chubb. Beautiful. That was very necessary. We needed the damage up, really. Our damage was kind of suffering. I mean, it's pretty good. Our damage isn't bad. But for how late we are in the game, and the, considering we've got Guppy as well, like, I don't, I don't mean as in we weren't dealing enough damage, but our damage stat wasn't great. There we go. Killed you right through your army, you big bitch. Not invincible anymore, are you? Same with you fellas. I love that mod. Being able to shoot through those. I've been asking for that forever. Just give him a lot of armor and don't make him invincible. Making enemies invincible is dumb. If I've got enough power to kill them, I shouldn't have to wait. Oh, I've got um thingy, haven't I? I forgot about that. Book of Secrets. I forgot I had a backpack. Book of Balal's kind of a good one to keep for us, to be honest. Let's go to our double cash rooms here. So many red chests. Wow. Okay, magic skin takes the cake here. We'll be taking that. 
We just need to find our secret room and magic skin will be a, a pretty perfect addition to our run here. Right, is this our secret room? It's not. Okay, let's take a little look around, shall we? This could be it too. We've got so many bombs, we might as well just try everywhere. It is here, nice. Ooh, you are ultra. You see these dodges? Ain't no one can dodge like me. That is fat odd mushroom, and it is gone. Oh, what the hell? Where'd this come from? I got we need to go deeper. I don't really know where from. Wait, what? Where'd magic skin go? I'm so confused. <laughs> what? What? I'm so very confused. What? I didn't mean to do that. Guess we're going down quickly. I, I used it on what I thought was a decal. Apparently it wasn't. So I thought it was going to be a crawl space, and I went straight down it. So we skipped the mum's heart fight. Not that we really needed to do the mum's heart fight, but still. Not a great idea to skip it, to be honest. Another three red chests. Wow. So many health upgrade buddy pills as well. Right, this time actually take a look at where we're using- Oh wait, the shawl doesn't work anymore, does it? <laughs> it was a bit of a shame that magic skin was a one and done sort of deal for us there. We didn't even get an item from it, technically. We got this shovel from somewhere, but I don't know where. Okay. You guys are going down to my swarm of tears. Cash room, come to me. No red chest in this one, surprisingly. Yeah, if I use this in here, yeah, it does literally nothing. Although, wait, what the fuck? There's apparently... Oh, there it is. More health I can't take. Yeah, the Dominic rooms are still a bit broken. Still a little bit broken. They tend to just open sometimes for no reason. I'll certainly accept it, but I don't know why it happens. Yo, oh god, you're spawning all sorts of stuff. Please no eternal Satan, by the way, because I don't know if I can deal with that. I have a decent run, but not like a great run. I suppose a little dumpy helping out is uh, pretty top tier, though. <coughs> yeah, little dumpy is, is doing a great job. Okay, no, not eternal. Good, good. I love that that bomb tactic has just always worked for the entire life cycle of Isaac. It's never changed. That bomb tactic has always been tried and true. I love it. Wake up, Dumpy. Okay, that's one holy mantle. And then two. We've had two uses out of uh, Dumpy so far. He's incredible. This is actually a really good fight for us because we're going to leave so many tears on the screen. He's just going to step into them all the time. Got to make him step up at the top of the screen whenever possible. It means you can see a lot more. If this isn't going so quickly, to be honest. See if I can plant some bombs around. Don't know if that's really going to do much for us. Okay, there you go. We got him. And then we can take the devil deals as we go here. See if there's anything we want to re-roll first, though. Don't know what it is. Oh, wait. It gets rid of all the chests. Do you know what? I got conjoined for it. That means it's fine. Don't know why these guys aren't firing, but I don't need to know. 
Yeah, I'm actually kind of okay with taking Headless Baby now that I know I got conjoined from it. Otherwise, I would have been a bit mad because I, I I thought you could take all of the items, but they must have they must have nerfed that or patched it or whatever. I haven't played Lost in quite a while to the dark room, so I do not know. Last assist you take forever to kill. This way. Lucky doesn't take too long though. Sadly, we don't have a huge luck upgrades though, so we're not getting any, uh, not getting any extra chesties. Or not, we're gonna we might, we might get a few, but we're not gonna get many. God damn, there's so many of these things. Little explosive sperms. I don't want to deal with you fellas. You creep me out a bit. God damn, I hate these little teleporter things. The vanishing twin enemy. There's a chest! Ha 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 ha! Okay, big boy. Ooh, you tried it, you tried it. Where are you popping up? There you are. Get a face full of that, please. And then there is a Loki somewhere around here. Here he is. I hate Lokis in big rooms. You can just teleport around the, the whole map. Ooh, this is a spicy room. Kind of an interesting one. Especially where this guy's throwing troll bombs at us. Stop. He's locked me in with it. Oh, really? Okay, at least we can dig up some of these. God damn it, stop giving me red chests, game. Bird cage. Exactly what I always wanted. We did get a shot speed up and a speed up, though, so. That's pretty good. Can't be through this thin room, right? No, I didn't think so. Kind of a tricky one. Shot speed up again. Shot speed is actually really good with this setup. Which means our pop tier is like traveling around a little more, bouncing around, getting more damage on. And the like. It's gotta be this way. I just like fit, like getting right up in their face. Your maximum damage. Take care of you first. I'll try at least. I think this guy looks really good as Eternal. There's so many troll bombs about. The horn enemies love their troll bombs. I do have another charge of the shovel, but I don't really think it's worth going back because this is this gotta be the boss like right here. Oh my god, I've been traveling for so long. Where, where the hell's the boss? Why is this floor so large? Also, let, let me grab that card. Oh, it's the stars. God damn it. Here it is. We found it. And we got a chest to end it off. We got Lacrophagy. Oh, wait. Lacrophagy is kind of an insane pickup here. We might get some insta damage here. We just need to stay on top of keeping little Dumpy awake. Lacrophagy is, like, insanely broken, so we might be able to get some insta-damage hits here if we're lucky. <coughs> <coughs> Damn. This is going to be kind of rough. We, we, need a, we need a Lacrophagy chain early. Basically... The way that Lacrophagy chains work, from what I understand, is you get you you want to get one tier to a maximum size and have it explode directly on top of the enemy, and then all of the tiers hit, but all of those tiers also collide, creating another big tier, and it kind of just does an instant hit of insane damage. That's at least how I think it works. I'm not 100% on that, but even with enemies with their uh, boss armor, 
you can like one shot them if it works it you do kind of need specific builds to make them work i will say it, do, it doesn't just oh god damn it it doesn't just work off of the bat i thought a little dumpy would be way more valuable to us here but he's proving to not be I really should be throwing my bombs down just because I have explosion immunity. Like my bombs are going to go literally all over and might not hit him, but they can't hit us, so. They do keep bouncing backwards, though, which is rather annoying. So many herbing shots, stop. Just keep a little dumpy away. Damn. No, 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 no. So fortunately, little dumpy cannot help me against the brimstone beam, and I did not see that one coming. dashed me you fucker damn it i didn't see the dash coming there's so much on screen right now it's the homing shots he fires way too many homing shots then again though i said it before i'm really glad this fight is actually challenging now and not just a steamroll Need to stop triggering little dumpy by accident here. He's got a like 10 second refresh, so. I can't believe how close. Dude! Stop with the brimstones! Come on now! What are you doing? You didn't do any brimstones the first few times. Little dumpies away from me as well. I need to get him back. Okay, you're dead. That's good. That does not exonerate us. It does not put us in the safe mode. But it does make things significantly easier for us. Because the body can only do a certain few attacks. And none of them are brimstone. We did it. My god. There you go. I hope you guys did enjoy this one. Absolutely cracker of a run. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.